Okay, so this is um, who was called Paul, we've now named him Henry after the charity who funded for him. So Henry's a um, 27 week high fidelity mannequin. Um, we're the first in Europe to purchase him apparently. So we're really very lucky. Um, and the reason that why we've um, purchased Henry is because um, our birth rates have deteriorated over the years. Um, we don't have the same exposure to neonatal emergencies as what we did. So in order to keep up our skills, um, the way that in which we do that is through simulation. So Henry is a 27 week infant. He can, he has heart sounds. He is breathing currently. Um, his um, abdomen will distend, go blue, to help facilitate clinical emergencies that we come across with these kind of babies. So you can hear him crying there. And he does grunting noises as well, which facilitates respiratory distress. So the really good thing about him is that when we intubate a baby, if we do it on a normal mannequin, the cords and the esophagus doesn't look very real, but he's got 3D printed cords. So when we intubate, it looks very realistic. So, which is a great tool for us to be able to do training with the doctors on how to intubate a baby um, and look for other signs as well. So his abdomen has gone blue, which can be a sign of necrotizing and pterocolitis. Um, so they would, we would expect them to act upon that and as a medical emergency and go through the whole process. So that would be kind of one of our simulations. He's got real hair. Um, he's got a fontanelle, so he's got a soft spot no. on his head. Um, we can listen to heart sounds, so we've got a special stethoscope with him as well. And that gives us different heart sounds, different lung sounds, um, which then they can act upon and facilitate the right um, sort of treatment to be given to these babies. So, um, so he's great for us because previously, we'd have a very, not very realistic looking mannequin and it trying to get people into the mode of this is a real life situation, treat it as a real life situation was really quite difficult. So now that we've got Henry, we can, it's the, the buy-in is so much better. People like him, they like doing the sim. So um, yeah, he's, uh, he's great. So we're really happy with him.